connect a charger to your television and you'll have the best reception. Pay close attention so you don't miss a single detail. To begin, the first thing we'll do is connect a charger to your television. Now, with the help of tweezers, we'll attach this part. We're going to remove the black cover from the charger as shown on the screen. Once removed, we'll have two cables inside, typically in these colors. Now, using the same tweezers, we'll expose the copper within each cable, and it should appear as demonstrated on the screen. Then, we'll take a coaxial cable, like the one shown here. Well, cut the black part of the cable to reveal the copper elements that are inside. These elements that you see here are external filaments that well roll back to expose the copper. Once this is done, we'll attach a terminal like this one to the end of the cable. Then, we'll take the other end of the cable and we'll mark the cut at an approximate distance so that it comes off more easily. We'll make movements upwards and downwards. Then, with tweezers, we'll finish removing the section we previously cut. Once cut, we'll take the filaments and twist them together like this. Then, we'll take the charger and roll one of its cables around the filaments that we exposed earlier. Well, wrap the other cable from the charger in the filaments we rolled earlier. It should look like this. Now, we'll separate the filaments from the copper that we exposed earlier. Here, we'll leave the copper up and the filaments down, just like this. With insulating tape, well secure the filaments to the copper, ensuring to cover everything completely. We'll also cover the copper with insulating tape as shown on the screen. This is how it should look when we're done. Now it's time to connect it to the TV and test it. As you can see, the channels are coming in clearly on the TV after the antenna modification. If you've made it this far, leave TV emojis so that Osseo knows you followed the entire tutorial.